Hello guys, see you again on the Mayunix channel. In this video I will show you how to update Mac OS Monterey 12.2.1 to Mac OS Monterey 12.3 on an unsupported Mayabook. In this video I use OpenCore Legacy Patcher version 0.4.3. So to download Mac OS Monterey 12.3 you need OpenCore Legacy Patcher because unsupported Mayabooks can't download Mac OS Monterey directly via the App Store. Ok before I start this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Ok, I'll check about this Mac first to make sure it's the Mac OS Monterey version before it's updated. As seen in about this Mac, the version of Mac OS Monterey is version 12.2.1. Now open your favorite browser. In the Google search box, type OpenCore Legacy Patcher. And then hit enter. On the search results page, click on the dot slash OpenCore Legacy Patcher, GitHub link. Under releases click latest. Scroll down to Assets. Under Assets there are several downloadable file options. There are open core files which are GUI based. And other terminal based open core files. Because this tutorial uses a GUI based open core then click the open core patcher GUI offline file. Wait for the open core patcher file download process to finish. Now click on show in finder. Extract the downloaded open core patcher file. Drag and drop OpenCore Patcher to desktop. I moved it to the desktop to make it easier to find the OpenCore Patcher files. Right click on the OpenCore Patcher file and then click open. In the pop up window that appears, click open. The main open core patcher window contains several menus. Because I don't have the Mac OS Monterey 12.3 file, so I have to download the Mac OS Monterey 12.3 file first. Click create Mac OS installer. Then click download Mac OS installer. Wait for the Mac OS catalog download process to complete. Now click on Mac OS 12.3 for the latest Mac OS Monterey. Wait for the download process for Mac OS Monterey 12.3 to complete.
In the pop-up window that appears enter the Mac admin password. Then click the OK button. OK, the download process for Mac OS Monterey 12.3 is complete. Now close the OpenCore Legacy Patcher window. OK, I first checked the downloaded Mac OS Monterey 12.3 file. The downloaded Mac OS Monterey file is already in applications. Now I need to install OpenCore Legacy Patcher 0.4.3 to SSD. Open up OpenCore Legacy Patcher again. Now click on build and install OpenCore. Click build OpenCore. Then click the install OpenCore menu. Select the SSD to be installed OpenCore. Then click the EFI SSD menu. In the pop-up window that appears enter the Mac admin password, then click the OK button. Now close the OpenCore Legacy Patcher window. Now open Finder. Then run install Mac OS Monterey. In the install Mac OS Monterey window click continue. Click agree and click agree again. Then click the continue button. In the pop-up window that appears enter the Mac admin password, then click unlock. Then wait for the Mac OS Monterey 12.3 update process to complete. Enter your Mac admin password to log into Mac OS Monterey desktop. Uncheck Enable File Vault Disk Encryption. Then click the Continue button. OK. The update process for Mac OS Monterey 12.3 is complete. Now check about this Mac. On about this Mac graphics display only 3 megabytes. So I need root patch for graphics display to be detected. Now open again open core legacy patcher. Now click the post install root patch menu. Then click on the start root patching menu. In the relaunch as root window click yes. In the pop-up window that appears enter the Mac admin password. Then click the OK button. Now click the post install root patch menu. Then click on the start root patching menu. Wait until the root patching process is complete. Root patching process is complete, then close the OpenCore Legacy Patcher window. Restart the MacBook for patches to take effect.
now check again on about this Mac. As you can see graphics display has been detected as Intel HD Graphics 4000. And also the Mac OS Monterey version is already version 12.3. Then check other parts working normally or not. So that's it, if this video is useful don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead. See you in the next video.